big news for many parents. There is money headed your way starting next month. Monthly child tax credits are set to begin as part of a federal recovery effort. Valerie Juarez reports on the changes and what people can, with children can expect. When you add diapers to buy, mouth to feed and other daily expenses, it's no secret that raising a child can get expensive. The credit is now much bigger, upwards of $3,600 for certain dependents. Uh, the money is refundable, which means you don't have to have tax liability or income of any type uh, to get the credit. But most importantly, the big change feature is that it'll be prepaid in part starting in July. In the past, families would get the credit as a lump payment once a year. But with these advanced payments starting July 15th, parents will get a direct deposit of $300 a month for each child under 6 and $250 for each child 6 to 17 years old. The benefit is part of the Biden administration's massive $1.9 trillion coronavirus rescue plan. It was 40% of taxpayers that we surveyed, and it's a pretty big base, did not even realize there were changes to the child tax credit program. And this was after the law was passed. So for whatever reason, a lot of folks may be surprised when money starts showing up in their checking account or checks start arriving in the mail. But either case, when money starts arriving from the IRS, you need to pay close attention. For one Brown County organization, they say this credit can also Help parents struggling to pay for child care. It can be more expensive to send your infant to child care than it can to send your child to college for the university tuition. So the child tax credit may be able to really help those families. These changes are temporary and run through December. In Brown County, Valerie Juarez, NBC 26. So to recap, the IRS will begin sending out the payments July 15th. The payments will be monthly for six months with the final one coming in December. The payments are $300 a month for children five and younger. The payments are $250 a month for children six to 17 years old. Those payments altogether make up half of the total credit. The other half would be paid the same as in years past, that is, as part of a tax return. Parents can also decide to get the entire credit as part of that tax return instead. Now, the IRS looks at 2020 taxes to determine eligibility. The credit is available to families who have an adjusted gross income of uh, less than $75,000 for single parents, $150,000 for married couples who file together.